Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're covering a shocking story from Texas where a powerful hailstorm wreaked havoc on a massive solar farm. Imagine this, baseball sized hailstones falling from the sky, smashing through thousands of solar panels, turning them into shattered glass. Millions of dollars in green energy were wiped away by a touch of icy rain. It's a stark reminder that Mother Nature can be brutal, even as we strive for greener energy solutions. Many claim that the solar panel chemicals leak into water tables, which could have carcinogenic effects. Know these and more by completing this video till the end. So how did this happen and what does it mean for the future of clean energy in Texas? Let's get into it. Let's first answer the following question. What happens when a hailstorm meets thousands of solar panels? Well, on March 15th, a solar farm southwest of Houston found out the hard way. The Fighting J Solar Farm, which covers an enormous street and 300 acres, took a beating as hailstones the size of baseballs came crashing down. Aerial footage captured rows upon rows of cracked photovoltaic cells. Just imagine the damage. This solar farm, which had been cranking out 350 megawatts of electricity to power 62,000 homes, is now limping along at reduced capacity. How's that for a weather disaster? Is there more to worry about than just broken panels? Some locals are concerned about what happens when these shattered panels start breaking down. Solar panels often contain toxic materials like cadmium telluride and copper indium gallium deselenide. Fancy words for stuff you definitely don't want in your drinking water. The good news? Experts say the chemicals are sealed in a solid form and aren't a risk unless the panels are disposed of incorrectly. Plus, hazardous materials teams have been on the scene and so far no contamination has been found. Still, the idea of cracked panels leaching chemicals is enough to make anyone nervous, especially when it's your water supply on the line. Now we will move to an important point. Could solar panels survive such extreme weather? You'd think they would be built for it, right? Solar panels are designed to withstand wind, rain and even hail, but there's a limit to their toughness. According to research from the National Renewable Energy Laboratory, hail cracked panels only lose about 4% of their energy output. But we're not talking about little pebbles here, these were baseball sized hailstones. Even the Department of Energy admits that hail this big packs enough punch to completely shatter the glass. It's like throwing rocks at a window, eventually something's going to give. Now you may ask, is climate change fighting back? As ironic as it sounds, this incident brings up an important question. Are our clean energy efforts vulnerable to the very weather changes they're trying to prevent? Texas has seen some wild weather recently and experts warn that extreme events like this hailstorm could become more common due to global warming. Droughts have already slashed hydropower in places like California and a brutal winter storm knocked out the Texas power grid in 2021. It seems like every time we try to move toward cleaner energy, the weather is getting in the way. So what's the next move for green energy in the face of such unpredictable weather? Can we stop this from happening again? While you can't stop a hailstorm from coming, there are ways to minimize the damage. One of the top solutions is installing hail resistant panels. Some manufacturers are already working on tougher glass and materials that can withstand larger hailstones. Another option is deploying automated protection systems. Think of retractable covers that can shield the panels when a storm's on the way. Solar farms can also be equipped with advanced weather monitoring systems to predict and respond to extreme conditions. These strategies can help protect future solar investments from getting smashed by mother nature. What are your views about this event? Your remarks encourage us to continue our efforts to promote renewable energy in the hopes of a clean and bright future. Please don't forget to like, 
share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.